I, I just think she's a lot better than that ranking suggests. Nine. Ready to go here for the third leg. Ten points all between the Gujarat Panthers and the Punjab Bulls. And I'm joined by my good friend, my the mentor of Maharashtra tennis, Mr. Nandan Bal. First point. Start love all. Gargi to serve. Great shot. Great shot to start. As like we said, I could agree with you. The Gujarat Panthers may be the underdogs here, but they're definitely starting well. Well, they're not going to go down without a fight. No question about that. Bhakti's got a great attitude. You know, she's always jumping. She's always positive about everything she does. That's what I'm talking about. There it is, Prina with the top spins, the underspins, and finally a beautiful volley right down the middle to put away the point. One all. Double fault. Q1. The double Punjab fault Bulls. could be costly, giving the Punjab Bulls slight advantage. But I think they're looking good. They can bounce back. They can bounce back. The key really is not to give anything away. They've, they've got to make the other yes. team earn their point. Good second serve. Good deep second Three serve on the line. Goal. And that helped them to break away. They're now up 3-1. Great second serve. I mean, that sort of pace for an under-18 girls player. Remarkable to see in Indian tennis. Good point again. Good point again. Four Once again, Prerna being the dominant Fighting. player there from the back of the court. And as they take that first break, they are up 4-1. Great. So, Nanda, just to put you on the, to the spot for a second, where do you see a future for Prerna, Gargi? What what are they, where, how do they improve? What is the next steps? How, how can we make them into remarkable women's tennis players, singles or doubles. You know, Pura, these, the one good thing that you see with the younger generation is that they are very hard working and they need to be rewarded for that. So at the end of the day, I think it's the corporate sponsorship that's going to help them achieve their dreams. And I think a league like this is the one that's going to let corporates notice these girls so that they can help them. Lovely. Absolutely, and I think, um, that's the way that's the way of every sport has grown and I think tennis is no different. A yep. shot so once again Five the Punjab one, girls Punjab are goal. just so good at the net. Both Gari. Gari is the solid one. Prerna is the innovative one, and together they are cleaning up right now. 5-1, usually. Great hands. So, safe to say, women's, girls under 18 doubles has come a long way since the last decade. Second serve. Oh, one 
once again, Fred Ambul, a little too early there, giving a concerted opening on that down the line. And it's 5-2. But yes, uh, you know, 10 years ago, women's girls doubles, boys doubles also, four girls playing singles. <laughs> and now you actually <laughs> see them playing good doubles. <laughs> I think one box. Challenge. Gujarat Masters would like to challenge the ball. The ball was called out on serve. Hold out there. Second serve, Gargi. Little long on that forehand. And it's 5 3, Punjab. The Bulls, an interesting two points coming up. The difference can be four, it can be even. That's where the, I think this is where we get the real benefit of playing matches like this. This is where the girls really benefit. The pressure's on them. Let's see if they can strike. Oh, beautiful. Beautifully done by Prerna. Red Bhakti's move was ready for that forehand volley and made sure she put it up, put it away to give Punjab the 6-3 lead. And as we come into the last point, we have Bhakti serving. Trying to reduce the deficit to two points. No, it doesn't seem big now, but as the matches add up, this can be huge. That's right. As we had suggested earlier, Punjab was the better team, and they have now cut loose. They have taken a four-point lead. 7-3, Punjab Bulls. Just like that, 7-3 on the score, 7-3 on the team score, 7-3 on the individual score with the four-point lead. Final scores here. 3-7, 7-3, 3-7. Wow, can the next one be 17-13 then? <laughs> Wouldn't that be interesting? Anyway, it's 17-13 to the Punjab.